As you can imagine, these storms did cause some damage and left people's nerves very frayed. Jake Peterson is live with more. Jake, you've been following it too. Yeah, we rode out one of those storms in the Platte City Western area, and one of them came through about 8.30 tonight. We saw some heavy rain, wind, lightning. All of it's pretty much calmed down up here in the, the northern area. We are still seeing some lightning. That's why we're using the Skype technology uh, to bring you that. Now, we did speak with some gas station owners who were, who were preparing for tornadoes, uh, so they feel very fortunate tonight. But things, it was very different over in Kansas side or in Oskaloosa. A tornado did rip through part of that area there. We're told that they, uh, some folks... In a, at the Lakeside Village Mobile Home Park, we're told that a tornado came through there. A tree actually fell right through one of the mobile homes, and an elderly couple was inside of that home. We're told that they're doing okay, but they are trapped. And so the fire department there is working right now to try to get those folks out in Oskaloosa. They also had some rain over there in that area as well, rain hail, but right now we're not hearing too much damage besides some trees that were uh, torn down. And back here in Platte City, we also had no reports of any injuries or damage from hail or wind or anything like that. So again, right now, pretty calm here in Platte City. We're just seeing some lightning, and that's the latest here. Back to you guys in the studio.